Hello again, that's Rebecca here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to day 14 of May I Scrap Lift You. Today I am scrap lifting the lovely Scrappy Kathy and here is the layout that I picked out. She has one beautiful stencil right there. Photo cluster down here and then cluster up the good embellishment cluster up there and the whole thing is matted. So we're going to use our white cardstock. I'm going to finish off the concert that my husband took his daughter to. So these photos are horrendous, but you know, they're still their memories, so I don't want to get rid of it. So I want to get one on here. We need to here not give it on. Well, please, we're just gonna go right there, and we are gonna trim all of these little suckers down. Yes, I have to find a stencil, but as you can see, whoever was taking the picture was dancing or having just a good old time, and God loved them for taking the picture. But the photos, the, the you know, it was not right, not the right element, I guess. For, solid photos every time. So I do want this one to go here. Oh my word, why are these like not? Why does anything work today? Okay. So we've got that one which will sit there. These guys over here. And then we'll have one photo that is just sitting right there. So you can flip it, you can kind of see them all. Um, but actually, that's going to be all down here anyway. Probably could have made those smaller, but eh, just go with it. Uh, I'm going to use this collection. I don't remember if I've got a stencil or not in here, and it looks like I do not. Not a lot of scratch paper, so I was doing something. Okay, what do we got? What's Kathy got going on? Just a few bits behind the I need a dark background. I think I'm going to take that guy right there. That guy, wasn't there another one? Is there another one? That one. Okay. No, stick with your original idea. Because I like I want to bring in the orange and stuff. That one. Oh, that was too much. I'm just gonna take all of this and put it over here. And so then we'll have our paper matted like so. And we're going to pull in some of these guys and make some of those wonky strips in there, right? So, that way we can bring some more of the um, I don't know what I'm saying. You know what I'm trying to say. Alright. I need to find a stencil and I think I'm going to go with an orange to match this. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. So give me a minute. I'll be right back. All right. So I took dried marigold and used a close to my heart stencil. Now I just, that was an oxide ink. I'm going to spritz it lightly. Then we 
I'm just going to pop up some of that water. Kind of a weathered look. All right, so now I need to trim. I did mess up right in here, but I was like, man, I thought I was going to have to do it again. <laughs> As you can see where I stencil moved, let's be honest, but that's where this is going to go. So it's not going to matter anyway, right? I'm going to trim this. I am going to gut this paper just because it's too pretty. Usually I'm not a big uh, gutter, but I'm going to do that. So let me go ahead. I'm going to trim like a quarter of an inch off of each side, gut that, get my photos placed down, and we will uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. <laughs> so I'll be right back. All right, so I got my, my paper pieces wonkily put it behind here. I've got my flip flap on. I've got two little tags right here so they kind of come in with that cluster. I've got a, or tickets, I've got a tag here, a chipboard piece and a butterfly. Went ahead and clustered some of the laurels up. Let's see what else we can have, because I'm looking Let's see. Oh, oh my heart, that's, that's straight. My heart's crooked. Okay. Okay, there. else we have oh, she's upside down and it totally annoys me every time I see it it's it's not it just looks crooked hmm this it's straight that's all I can say put all this photo right here um, she's got a worry bit on her I hope I don't rip it. These are a little bit on the thin side. Usually I always rip the sticker. Happiest ever. He was very happy getting to share going to the Grateful Dead. Oh, and also, this was just a perfect photo to scrap lift my lovely friend Kathy because her husband John was a huge Grateful Dead fan, and this is a Grateful Dead concert, so that's all I'm saying. It was like meant to be. Heart right there. What else do we have? We have a plethora of things. Heart down here. Because why not? Bird in there as well. I need something more up here. I just don't know what. Oh, happy bunny.
No naked tag holes. Been perfect. But there's no teal on the page. Um, long. Just a little bit more yellow in there as butterflies. And I don't think we have any new. I'm going to use the Speaker Mom scrub sequence, but I'm kind of feeling it just the way it is. So here is my lovely friend's original. I did. She's a little bit more centered to where I'm way bigger <laughs> with my mixed media, but I'm digging it. I'm really feeling it. So and then, you know, little flipper flapper so we can see more of their crazy antics behind there. But then this is complete, and that's one more check mark for items done for 2022. Don't forget to check everyone else out that's playing along with May I Scrap Lift You. And definitely go check out my sweet friend, Scrappy Kathy, and see all the fun that she creates. She is an amazing mixed media artist, so please head over, check her out. And I will see you guys later. Don't forget to do all the fun YouTube-y things. Bye.